Yeah. S1K, what's going on? What's going on, man? What's happening? Shit, not much. You ready to get this uh interview going? Yeah, yeah, I'm ready, bro. So, you know what I'm saying? Talk to me about your name, S1K. Where you uh where you get that from? Well shit, at first, bro, I got down, it was uh Savage. But you know, around that time when I first started rapping that shit, uh 21 Savage came out. Yeah. We got Wavy Trill Savage and some more Savage, you know, Savage with the money sign, shit like that. So uh as the years been going by, I was just thinking, like, what can I do? Then I changed the Savage 1K. So when I changed that, I was like, oh man, it still it ain't gonna catch nobody eyes, it ain't different, you know what I mean? So I shortened it. Basically it's just abbreviation, you know what I mean? So I changed it to S one K, so it stands for Savage One K, but uh, S one K is me now. I got you. I got you. So you know what I'm saying for somebody who hasn't heard your music, explain what type of artist you are. Well, shit, the kind of artist I am, I'm authentic all the way, bro. I'm real, like I, you know, a lot of people say that no cap shit, but I don't lie in my rap at all. You know what I mean? Like everything honest. You know what I mean? From the, from the struggle all the way to the pain to where I'm headed. So. You know, I grew up on down south music, 90 rap. You know, my daddy put me on everybody, Master P, A Ball, MJG, and all that shit was that real shit. So yeah, yeah. You know, that's all I'm on, bro. I got you. So are them, are them some of your, you know what I'm saying, your favorite artists? Hey, yeah, bro. Really, everybody from the south, bro. Three Z Mafia, uh, UGK, uh, J everybody. Yeah, man, I got you. Head, Master P, everybody from the south for Atlanta, Pastor Troy, uh, uh, what their name is? Who that? Oh, some DSGB? Yeah, yeah, no, um, Pastor Troy got nine. Outcast. Outcast, okay. All them folks, bro. Like, everybody from Atlanta. T.I. for T.I., I grew up on Gucci, man. You know what I mean? Gucci and Jeezy. And Jeezy, okay. I, mean? I, I was fucking with both of them, but I was on Gucci side. I got <laughs> you, I got you. I ain't gonna count. I like, I like, I like Jeezy, my Jeezy Ooh, always my he favorite. He's like my daddy, bro. Like, I grew up listening to him. I yeah. know all his music. Yeah, hey, yeah. But, like, when it was with the beef in and and you know Gucci content the trap music. Yeah, man. I got you. I got you. Yeah. I ain't, hey, you ain't wrong. You ain't wrong with picking either one. But you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, like I, I love for sure both got that you. music, but Gucci my nigga, man. I got you. Yeah. So um, you know what I'm saying? Let's talk about some of your music. I see that uh, you had was it a mixtape or a single or uh, triple bean scale? Yeah, triple bean scale is on the product of my environment mixtape. I released that in November 2018. 2018. I yeah. see that it did like yeah. 15,000 streams yeah. or something like yeah, that. Yeah, bro. Like, you know, they fuck with the old mid tape, but it, even I myself felt like True Bean Scale would be the hit. Yeah. The real is the intro of the mid tape. I got a video of real. That shit t- doing 10,000 streams on, you know, YouTube. So I got you. Okay. Mid tape doing good, but I felt like I ain't promote it as good as I could because I was trying to find my way in the industry. You know, yeah. I just work with the music. You know what I mean? So how long, how long you been rapping? Shit, since 2015. So like, about... Four like, years, four years, okay. Four years, but like, you know, in high school, nigga I used to freestyle and shit with uh-huh. the partners and shit. And them nigga were better than me. You know what I mean? Like, them nigga could speak better than me. But I guess, you know, after high school and shit, I took the rap shit more seriously. Yeah, they you fell know? off. You just, I got you. Yeah, yeah. I got you. So, um, you know, from the beginning of your career up until now, like, have you found uh, better ways in, like, navigating the industry? Hell yeah, bro. Like, I, I was like perfecting my career for first, first three years. Yeah. You know what I mean, so when it was time to release the mixtape, uh, I was, the plan was to promote it for like six months. You know yeah. what I mean? Promote it for like six months. Don't um, be too spaced out because you got to release new music. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I was fucking with niggas, bro. And you know, IG is the main source of finding people who you need to fuck with, you know, as far as the music. And, that's why I was saying in my video I posted yesterday on IG, you can't got um just get too excited and just pick anybody. Yeah. You gotta do your research, bro. You gotta actually understand who to fuck with and who not to fuck with, cause you'll end up getting your money to the wrong person. True. You don't get nowhere.